Hello YouTube, this is Science, and this is part 4 of my hideout series. This, this, um, hideout is located in Kalendor, Northern Barrens, and right under here. Um, what you could do is you could just fly to right here, go down the road, and take a left, and then go up some. It's kind of hidden, like it's not one of... It's not a well-known place, but here it is, and I even got um, a suit just for this series. It's the um, Twilight Cultist suits, and I also got a little pole arm and a back piece. But onward to the video. Now, this place it is in the woods, so you may not be able to see it from up top, but you should be able to. And as you can see right now, there's a house, a little wagon, and something that's very unique, there is a vendor. Now, he doesn't like sell food or anything, but he does sell weapons, and this fiery cloak, which looks like that, and this iron, ironwood mail, mall, I think it's called. So, those are the things that you can only buy one of. And it's usually something unique. These are green, so you can disenchant them if you buy them. And you can just love it like that. But also, there is an anvil and a forge here. So if you do blacksmithing, then that will be really good here. Um, something you should also um, note about this place is that it is, it is fairly secluded. There's not many animals going around here. There's a few zebras. Um, if you keep going straight, but it's mostly secluded. Um, a few trees around. It's pretty nicely decorated. It seems like this would be like sort of a small inn for a few questing. Um, this is actually one of my favorite because it has the vendor and the things for the professions. But it also has this little overpass thing, which is kind of like if you had vehicles or like animals or something. They have some crates right here and has the horde sign on it, which is pretty cool. Um, a little wagon, which you can actually go inside of. Um, I actually can't right now because I'm torn, but I have went on like a blood elf and all the other characters. Seems like the only ones that can't get into it is the orc and the torn because they are the tallest. I do not know about any of the light tombs. I have not went over here. But the orc and the torrent I know cannot go in there. You could try to do it, but yeah, um, I just couldn't do it. There are some torches right here to light it. It is again one of the things that fade in and out, and it has a nice roof over it. And let's go into the inside. It's not as well done as hideout as any of the other hideouts, but it is pretty good. It has the two hammocks. Um. The chest, some type of bottle, I'm assuming that's for money, some rugs underneath it, a little table and a candle, a book, some pelts, um, some more probably food things, and some weapons and a shield, and if you look up, it's a nice little star, so I thought that was pretty interesting. Okay. That is pretty much this whole hideout. Again, there are some animals, like off to the distance. I think they're level 14 to 16, so you shouldn't have that much trouble getting over here if you're that level. Or if you just have um, someone taking you. Again, um, here's the location. It's in Cal Calinmore, Northern Barrens. Oops. Northern Barons, just go here, go down and take a left, or you could just, um, just fly straight over. And, yeah. That's the end of the video, guys. If you like this, then like, comment, and subscribe, and there will be more to come.